Fuad, your group has looked into some of the financial concerns facing metastatic breast cancer patients at your institution. What prompted you to look into this issue? So we have a very unique model uh, for metastatic breast cancer. Uh, we opened a, a center called the Kuntz Center for Advanced Breast Cancer, which comprehensively evaluates and, and treats patients exclusively with metastatic breast cancer. And as part of our team, we have a psychologist and a social worker who evaluate every new patient. And so it became clear that the social work and psychological needs of these patients seem to be greater than uh, advanced cancer patients in general. And so we looked, about, uh, looked at systematically evaluating that. Um, and what we found is that compared to other cancer patients, the patients with metastatic breast cancer had 40% greater involvement with social work and 40% greater visits with social work. And primarily those visits centered around concerns regarding medication availability, financial toxicity. Um, you know, a lot of these uh, patients are young and working and the diagnosis of metastatic breast cancer affects their livelihood. And so the financial toxicities, transportation, mm -hmm. getting durable medical equipment, we found that all of those issues are much more significant in the metastatic breast cancer population than the cancer population as a whole. So thank you for sharing that. You shared some of the medical woes, some of the financial strain issues. What about the insurance needs and issues in that arena? Well, I think that's a major concern for particularly the younger patient population whose insurance may be tied to their employment and the metastatic diagnosis sometimes makes continued employment difficult, if not impossible. And so it, the consequence of that is that their insurance is in jeopardy. And so it's an added stress and uh, financial concern on top of the medical issues that they're dealing with. Absolutely. So what sort of change then is needed to address the unmet needs of metastatic breast cancer patients? Well, I think awareness. I mean, I think being aware that these needs exist and addressing them early on. I mean, patients who are generally doing well don't necessarily think about the, the future coming where they may no longer be able to work physically. And so we try and be proactive and discuss that with the patients. Our social worker discusses that with the patients up front to prepare them for that potentiality. Well, thank you very much for sharing this with our audience today. Thank you.